consensus ZK EVM private beta testnet has been live and ongoing. Rewards for beta testers has also been confirmed. This could be very big. Why do I think so? Because consensus is very rich and they have raised about $726 million in eight rounds and they are also investors in 14 crypto startups. In 2019, consensus acquired infora.io. I also believe that you know that consensus is the owner of Metamax. These guys are big players in the crypto industry. This is not a testnet that anyone can just get access to and start interacting. No, you first need to sign up for the testnet and get whitelisted. So about a few weeks ago, I posted this in my Telegram group and I want to believe that everyone that signed up as a then should have gotten an email right now to test the consensus ZK EVM testnet. If you haven't gotten an email, you don't need to worry. As long as you did everything correctly, you will definitely get an email to test out this amazing project. And just in case you are learning about this private testnet right now, as you're watching this video, you can still sign up for it by simply heading straight to this form and fill up your information right here. I'm going to be leaving the form in the description for you to sign up. It is pretty simple. Just enter your first name, last name, email address, say what you do and enter your wallet address. And then also, if you have not signed up for the Infra account proper, you need to go and register for Infra as well. I'll leave the link in the description. Just enter your email, impute any password of your choice, agree with them and create a free account. Then you're going to get an email from consensus confirming that you have registered for their beta testnet. And also they will inform you later if you have been whitelisted to test out the project. Okay. Welcome back to my channel. If you're yet to subscribe to this channel, please do it right away before going ahead to watch this video. Here we give you first hand information that will land you thousands of dollars as long as you are implementing or applying everything we talk about in this channel. Guys, let's take this channel to 5,000. Yes, we can do it. Please share this channel out there to all your friends and family members. Get them to subscribe. Now, I also talked about Metamax Mega Airdrop. If you have not seen this video, please go and watch it and do the needful. This could also be very big. Imagine the consensus ZK EVM reward and that of Metamask coming together at once. Guys, you cannot contain this. Just make sure you are doing everything we talk about in this channel. I also mentioned about Infra as well. Look at it here. You can go and watch this video as well and do the needful. Okay, now let's go and interact with the consensus ZK EVM private beta testnet. I'll head straight to my email. So I got this email just yesterday. You don't know how much I've been waiting for this email. Every day I search my email box because I know how important this is to me and also to people out there. This is one of the opportunities I strongly believe we make huge impact in the crypto industry. Okay, so let's say thank you for signing up to our consensus ZK EVM private better. And here is the information. This is why it is private to you and you need to have an Infra account. You see, the Infra endpoint access to consensus ZK EVM are now available. Where are they available? In your Infra account. Steps is a log into your Infra account and create a new key and select Web3 API. Okay, this is an example of what they are talking about. By the time you log into your account, you just select Web3 API and give the name of any project of your choice. After that, you will select your consensus ZK EVM testnet endpoint, which is somewhere around here. I'm going to show you how to do that. I have to head over to this link and start the process. Everything we need to do is basically in this portal. Okay, when you scroll down, you will see Infra RPC endpoint, which you're going to be getting from your Infra account. It is specific to you. And after that, you get to connect your Metamax. Then you need to get some Goli EATS. And also you need to bridge some EATS onto the ZK EVM. And then you'll be good to go. So just sit back as I take you step by step through the process. First, I'll go into my Infra account and get my RPC endpoint. So this is my Infra account. 
I already have some keys, but now I need to create another key. How do I do that? I head straight to create new key. Here you're going to select the network, which is Web3 API, and enter the name of your project. This is up to you to decide whatever project name you want to use. And next I'll hit create. I have successfully created a new key, which in turn has given me a consensus ZK EVM RPC. Okay, I'll scroll down a little to find out where my RPC is. Here it is, consensus ZK EVM. It says testnet and here is my RPC. I'll just copy it and head straight to the testnet portal, which is this, and I'll impute my RPC right here and click on next. That has been recognized automatically. If you have not been whitelisted, you will not be recognized. Next, I have to connect my Metamax wallet. Next, and connect. Metamax is connected. The next thing I have to do is to add the ZK EVM testnet network. I can do this manually. I can also do it automatically. So since I can do it automatically, let's just go ahead and do that by clicking on add ZK EVM testnet. Your Metamax pops up with the RPC information just go ahead and approve it and here we go consensus zk evm testnet you can switch network all right that is recognized but it says your goalie eat balance is t zero that means we need to start interacting right now what do we do next we head straight to bridge look at what it says non-white listed users risk losing access to any tokens bridge to zk evm you must be white listed i'll connect my wallet metamask nest and connect now we are connected it may also interest you to know that consensus already has an ecosystem of partners this is hope exchange bridge and they are one of consensus partners okay we have to move some funds from our layer one which is the goalie eat testnet into our zk evm which is layer two so let's select goalie here and the next one is zk evm so I have some funds in my goalie already. I'll just bridge some into ZK EVM. I'll go for one each. This is what it will give me in layer two. I'll just scroll down a little and click on send. And now I need to switch over to goalie. Click on switch. And then click on send. Confirming your Metamax. The bridging process has just started. It is going to take about 15 minutes to get confirmed successfully successfully breached over it was not up to 15 minutes so close this and the next thing we have to do is to bridge back a little amount from our zk evm into goalie so just change it by clicking on this arrow and i'll enter 0.02 i'm going to receive about 0.01 in my goalie i'll scroll down again and click on send and since i am bridging from zk evm into goalie i have to switch network click send confirm it in your wallet the bridging process has started again. It is going to take five minutes this time around. We have successfully bridged back from ZK EVM to Good Network. Okay, so close this. The next thing we have to do here is to go straight to Faucet. We mint 10 USDC. We're going to mint this two times, meaning we're going to have 20 USDC. And this will be happening in the Goli Network, not on the ZK EVM. Okay, click on Mint. We'll go ahead and switch over to Goli. Confirm it right away. That is minted successfully. Remember, I told you to do it two times to have 20 USDC. All right, we are done here. So go back to the testnet portal. Now we have to update our goalie balance. How do we do that? We just click on get balance. It is updated. The next one is to update our ZK EVM balance as well. Also click on get balance. Switch over to ZK EVM network. And is updated successfully as well okay this means we are very much good to go all right i'm going to come back to this but let's go over and do some swapping this is uniswap v3 they are one of the consensus partners as well so let's connect our wallets click on connect wallet metamax of course next and connect yeah we are connected and we are on the right network you need to swap some eats just click on select token we have consensus roll up wrap click on it read this and if you're happy go ahead and click i understand enter any amount of your choice i'll go for 0 0.2 and click on wrap confirm it it is pending 
it is successful look at our balance right here 0 0.2 eta okay let's also swap into usdc click on this and select consensus roll up usdc at the top now enter any amount of your choice i'll go for 0 0.1 wow that will give me almost 10,000 crusdc okay click on swap confirm the swap go ahead and confirm in your wallet that is successfully swapped 0 0.1 ether for 9,997 crusdc okay the next thing we have to do right here is to provide liquidity so we head straight to the pool and click on new position Click on select a token, go for CRUSDC. Now select the free tire. We have 0.05%, 0.3%, and 1%. I'll be going for 0.05. Click on it. Okay, and that has updated. Now enter any amount of your choice as well. I'll enter about 5,000 CUSDC that automatically balance the other side which is ETA. approve c r u s d c this is my first time and i have to give permission confirm it processing successfully approved now click on review and if you're happy with this information here you go ahead and click on add confirm it also in your metamax wallet successfully provided liquidity for ETA c r u s d c on the uniswap v3 pool close it our pool has been updated now we go again for a new position click on this now we have to first select a pair click on it and we'll go for consensus roll up wrap okay now select the c arrow us the c which is this and select a free tire as well 0.05 updated successfully Enter the amount of CUSDC you want to provide as liquidity, 3000. That has automatically been matched with CRAP ETA. Click on approve CRAP ETA. Give permission again. It's still our first time. Approval granted successfully. Click on preview. Again, if you're happy with the information right here, you go ahead and add it up. Confirm. Again, transaction is successful. We added liquidity for CRRAP ETA and CRUS the C on Uniswap V3 pool. So close it. Yeah, our positions has been updated. Okay, the next thing you want to do right here is to try to remove some part of your liquidity. Okay, so we click on the first one. Note that you may be getting this as an NFT later on. Okay, so click on remove liquidity and go for any percentage of your choice i will go for 25 click remove remove again and it's time to confirm the transaction once again click on confirm successfully removed 0 0.0059 eat and 1250 crus dc okay so go ahead and do the same thing for the other position if you want to all right let's go back to our testnet portal and like I told you, we're already good just the way we are right now. But then let's look at what they are saying right here. It says jump on the ecosystem page and just play with some already deployed dApps. Deploy your own smart contracts using Truffle or simply send your goalie eats between different accounts. Don't forget to come back with some good feedbacks. I think we have done part of the things that said here. Let's check out the Truffle and see what is in there. Truffle, the most comprehensive suite of tools for smart contract deployment. I don't know how to use the application yet, but then I'll find out and also let you guys know how it works. All right, let's go back. Let's check out the ecosystem page. These are their existing partners so far, and they're all in the ecosystem. Metamask, Infora, Truffle, Uniswap V3, we have used this, and Hop Exchange, we also used it to bridge not too long ago. Then lens protocol is also here i don't think this would be on the test net because it's very much running on the main net i'm looking forward to see what consensus does with this whether it will be used in the test net or we wait during the main net all right and they also have dex exchange i tried it also let me click on it to show you what it looks like 
this is dex exchange platform i tried it also but it's giving me errors and i hope that they'll be able to fix this very soon because the dex looks so beautiful to me okay let's go back to the testnet portal you can also view the block explorer if you want to do that it is up to you then i'll go back and show you the final thing we have to do which is down here is a give us your feedback this is very very important if you don't give a feedback you are likely to miss out from this airdrop so this is the most important thing they are looking at for i think so so click on it consensus zk evm feedback form it is very simple to fill no difficult tax it is how easy or difficult it is to use the zk evm testnet you can go ahead to answer this question based on individual experience and do the same for every one of them report your feedback and don't forget to put in your email address associated with your for our account this is going to be used to identify you when the time for the airdrop as well take it seriously okay so this is all i got to show you today thank you so much for watching i know definitely that you got value from this video smash the like button go ahead and let your friends and family members know about this opportunity they can still register if they are yet to do so and get whitelisted i'll see you in my next one don't forget we're gonna make it bye